Good morning, everybody. How are we doing? So yesterday's attempt was a fail, but it was it was good. I just need to stop doing shit. Um, today I've made that conscious, conscious, conscious decision to. Um, I'm gonna stay away from my phone as much as possible. Just texting clients, and that's literally it. I'm gonna stay away from my phone as much as possible. So this is my only technology for today. Um, rest day once again. I do quite like vlogging on a rest day just because it's quite nice. Just to. Yeah, just to rest and just talk shit however I feel, but obviously yesterday and things like that, I've just been getting in my own head, just putting myself under unnecessary amount of pressure, which isn't a bad thing, but I do it all the time, it happens kind of every now and then, just putting my, I'm like, I should be here and I should be achieving X or whatever it is, and I'm just like, dude, just be in the present, enjoy, be grateful, like, at the end of the day, we live in Dubai, in the marina, so it's pretty cool. So yeah, that's it, that is it. We're just gonna look at Steph right now. So we'll show you her check-in progress. Um, so obviously her being three weeks out from her pro shows in the US. Gonna make sure she looks good. She had a high day yesterday. Um, and we're just gonna check over her today. We might do another high day, I think we will. She's only up by like 100 grams. Um, so probably do another high day, not as high food. But yeah, that's it. So we'll just take you along our very chilled day. Yeah, it's other one. I feel like we should do them more often. Mm -hmm. How do you make them back? Put them like what, three times? Yeah, so like just water, a little bit of water, egg whites, oats, salt. I put those toffee drops in there. Mm -hmm. And then that's it, you stick it in there and just keep an eye on it. Just make sure you don't turn it into an omelette. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that's it, yeah. And then just keep take it out every like minute, minute and a half, and just mush it. Mm. And then you just leave it to go cold, and it kind of just gets harder. Depends how you like the texture of it. But you like it like a cakey mixture, don't you? Yeah. 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 So then you just have to let it go cold. And then you add blueberries at the end? Yeah, like when it goes a little bit cooler, then you can add like frozen blueberries. Okay. Because if you chuck them in too early, it kind of like turns a bit watery. So let this cool down first, then you can put them in. Mm. That's it. And then mm. cinnamon, obviously, for you. Yeah. That's it. Shit loads of cinnamon. <laughs> yeah, simples. Egg yolks. Mm, delicious. Three, two, one. I feel like it's weird your camera's over here. Cause I'm like... You have to look at the Yeah. Back. yeah. <laughs> It'd be easier if it was above. But... Yeah, true. Happy Saturday fam. So we're off to the coffee shop. Which is our normal Saturday morning routine. Is this your vlog or mine? <laughs> Why not both? To... Why not both? Just steal the content. <laughs> Try and fix it. Uh huh. Chill day. Very chill day. Mentally shut off. Uh huh. So we are. Well, I'm, I am. Three weeks out today. Two weeks until I to leave to the USA, and three weeks until you you go to the UK. Yeah. The eighth. Yeah. Eighth. Yeah. And then I'm to you on the seventeenth. Yep. Yeah. Cool. Shit. So Brandon is going to the UK first. Um, a week after I leave Dubai, so I'm going to the US about a week for my show, and then doing the first two shows with Claire, my fellow IPB bikini pro sister, and then Aussie Queens. Yeah, Aussie Queens. So we've got two shows together, and then um, so they're both back to back, two weekends in a row, and then we've got a weekend break, which is when Brandon joins me. <laughs> And we get some, get to enjoy Florida together, do the Florida show, go to Pittsburgh, and then Mexico. 
Cold. And heat cold. And back to the heat. <laughs> yeah, back to the heat. So we'll see how long we last. Um, got a little UK trip planned in July. Yeah, uh, is it July? July? Yeah. End of July. End of July, I think we're about to the UK for a week. Yeah. And then, and it looks like Australia. Yep. Australia. Well, you have to go back anyway. Yep. And then I might do my show in Australia. Yeah, depending we'll on see. competition dates. And then we might bounce to go on a little vacay in the summer if it gets too hot here. But we'll see. Good plans. Yes. Good plans. My club day yesterday. So we increased my rice in all my meals and increased my eggs as well. So my weight only went up by 100 grams this morning and I'm feeling really tight. And... Alright guys, we are. Look at that happy face. Mm -hmm. A little bit more food today again for her. The usual Saturday Saturday shop now is Kobe? Kobe. Kobea. Kobea. It's like a Japanese style restaurant. It's really cool. And but the Americano is lit. I said lit. Yeah. <laughs> um, so we're just gonna have this. I think we're gonna look at some like just apartment hunting for America. Um, I'm just kind of getting some bits. Steph still needs to sort out a flight as well, so we're just getting things like that done. But otherwise, just trying to stay away from my phone as much as possible and just have a very chill day. All right, guys, we are Airbnb hunting for Orlando, but there's too many fucking options, so <laughs> we're struggling a little bit. Hungry. I'm hungry, but we did it. We're getting there. Yeah, one left. One left, two. Oh no, the other one's done. No, the other one's done. Cancun's done, isn't it? Yep, yeah. just too long. That's all he's doing. Yeah. <sighs> cool. Um, yeah, that's it. Airbnbs for Pittsburgh and the other place, Orlando. Good. And I think we just need to arrange um, shuttle to one. That's it. You have to do that. Oh no, but you can just get a cab, can't you? Yeah, but I think you can get like a an actual thing. You know, like a bus thing? It's, it's yeah. two hours away. Oh, from the airport and then. Two to one. Okay, yeah, all sort of. Easy. I'll leave that to you. Yeah, happily. <laughs> Meal one of a rest day, so obviously food went up about 200 calories on kind of both days. So I think rest days now are like 3,600, something like that. So meal one, it's like 12 o'clock now, which probably isn't the best idea. I do need to get better at eating a little bit earlier because I don't know. I like eating more in the evening, so it's absolutely fine. Um, but meal one, we got cinnamon and raisin bagel. We got a, 150 grams of egg whites. Some mixed veggies in there, obviously don't track mixed veggies or any greens. Uh, 100 grams of salmon, two whole eggs, and that's it for yet. Super, super simple, nice fats, a little bit of carbs from the bagel. So we're going to do this, and then I'll just show you a full day of rest day food. So super easy. Can he see? I've probably got like 60 chins from this angle. <laughs> but I don't care. We are, well, messy, messy sops over there. Huh. Got half cinnamon down her body. <laughs> <laughs> we are, I don't even think that's pointed at you. Is it there? <laughs> yeah, I can see. Yeah. We are just taking an hour to soak up some D. And then we're gonna head to downtown for kind of like the, the afternoon. Um, go walk around the shops, do things like that. I don't know, I'm just hiding my eyes. Walk around the shops, things like that. Steph's gotta sort out with stuff with Claire, some flights and stuff, so. Yeah, we're just gonna do some window shopping. So, yeah. <laughs> Crazy day. All right guys, just before we go, downtown I'm just gonna have a little snack so I promise I do have 
got underwear on. I promise. <laughs> so we just got 360 grams of pineapple, so frozen pineapple. I'm literally going to turn some of my favourite whey protein into a bit of a paste with some almond butter. Uh, almond butter with almond milk. I'm just going to drizzle it on top. So we just got carbohydrates from the pineapple, and then I'm just going to do a little bit of a. It's like a, a whey paste. So you can make it kind of to a texture that you like and just drizzle it on. So super easy. And so you do guys, you just got it. The paste, a little bit of almond milk in there and you literally just mix it up. If you need to add more or less, you can do so. But I think, nailed it. So it's pretty good. It just turned into kind of, I kind of like it like a moussey texture. And then that's it. And then you can just drizzle it on. But let me move this a little bit. going to <laughs> uh, downtown um, Claire ended up coming to see Steph just literally next door to us because we couldn't get a ride we couldn't get a taxi because Dubai is busy at the moment so which actually quite was quite nice so we just get to chill now <laughs> so I'm just cooking up the last meals of the day um, I'm pretty much out of Steph's meal I actually needed to film in the client's library um, how to make some eggy oats so I'm gonna run through that I'm just getting all my my last three meals, kind of, but then I eat two together. Well, actually I'm eating all three together because, you know, I can, <laughs> simple as. So my last meals are, probably seen it a million times before. I don't think this lighting is very good, but I don't give a shit. So we got 125 grams of raw weight rice. We got 200 grams of chicken in there and peanut butter, 40 grams. That's just the, the best meal in the world. Pink salt, it's the one. Then I'm gonna have a cinnamon bagel and banana. I'm just gonna mush the banana on top. And then in here, which I completely forgot about, so please don't be fucked up, um, is 50 grams of oats and 100 grams of uh, like cream of rice or like rice flour. Um, and then I've got in here as well, 20 grams of orange dark chocolate. And then pink salt goes in with all our meals as normal. What else am I putting in here? What else have I got in here? That's a good question. Um, and I'm putting 480 grams of frozen fruit as well. And I'm going to do the whey paste on top of that as well that I made earlier for the pineapple. So... Uh, do you know what? Screw it. I'm changing it. This is the benefit of kind of off-season life. So we're gonna do blueberries instead because I I just want to do blueberries, blueberries, and blueberries is the one. Blueberries is the one. So we're gonna do blueberries instead. I'm gonna do 400 grams of blueberries instead. Just just the combo is nicer. So dark chocolate, orange dark chocolate, blueberries, frozen blueberries, and I will add on the whey paste as well, which I will make separately so you can see it again. But actually just, guys, I honestly like meals, like really, they don't really change much. Um, I think obviously the benefit of just being in off season is that you can just have a little bit more flexibility. Um, Everything should still just be as routine and structured as normal. But like you see, I have like sushi twice a week and things like that. So like this, you can you can do things like that. And like at the end of the day, it's just making sure you can eat foods that you digest well. Like everything I eat is something I've eaten in the past. So I'm like, oh yeah, I'll have that again. But it digests extremely well. Body absorbs the nutrients extremely well. So that's all that matters. And in the day it gets the job done and we're making some killer results so it's all good right get the whey paste done and then I'll make a Steph's meal 
So the whey paste isn't anything too fancy. We're just getting a scoop of the Perform Whey. And I just saw that um, Paul's just got all in the new flavors. I think it's like, they've got peanut butter jam flavor and they've got, oh, what was the other one? And they've got uh, chocolate orange in. So Perform, probably the best, best tasting protein on the market for sure. So we've got that. And then all we're gonna do is just a little bit of almond milk. Boom. And then we just try and make a paste. So we just mix it up, put a little bit in there, not too much to start, a little bit in, mix it up. And you can see it's a bit too powdery still. You can see it. A little bit too powdery still, so all we'll do then is just a little bit of almond milk. Mix until you kind of get the texture that you want. And if it's still not there, you just go again. And also it's getting there. A little bit more, but just do it in a little. Ah, oh, that's too much. Fuck it. <laughs> oh, I might not. No, it's not too bad because it. I like. It can go cold afterwards, so it's cool. Perfect. Just turn it into like a a mousse, so it's kind of like. Don't want it to fall out. So it's kind of like. Oh, it's not there. Let me get it in the lens. It's a bit like a moussey texture. And then all we do. And we just drizzle it on the oats and then the good tip is, is what you can do you could put it in the freezer or you could put it in the fridge as well and that would just make it taste absolutely bomb but we don't have time for that we're just gonna get the shower steps look at me like i'm a nut and you feel looking at me like i'm a nut <laughs> this moussey kind of thing which tastes absolutely bomber right my meals are done so it's time to make some eggy oats for Steph right eggy oats time so obviously she's got a little bit of um, a slight refeed today she had a like larger refeed yesterday but she she really didn't gain much weight um, so we just wanted to push the food a little bit higher today, so we kind of ran the 40 grams of oats that you saw this morning. All the other meals were the same. Were they all the same? Yeah. All the other meals were the same. So she's just going to go exactly the same meal, really, for tonight. So we've got, normally it's just 100 gra 150 grams of egg whites um, and 100 grams of veggies. So it's literally a carbless meal. And we used to make that a pancake, but we're going to do eggy oats tonight. So a little bit of water. Just a bit of water and then 150 grams of egg whites. Just super easy to digestible protein source. So literally the egg whites go straight in. 150. For her, I'm just being really anal on the numbers. So it's fine. <laughs> so she's got 150 there. She's we've also put in like some um Put in some like toffee flavor drops. So we've got like the my protein toffee flavor drops. I'm not sure if that's focusing. And then we've got pink salt in there as always. Just again, pink salt, just that kind of natural electrolyte. So we're just making sure we get that in. A little mix. And then all we'll do is just stick this in the microwave. And we just have to keep checking it. Um, Just to keep checking it so it doesn't turn into an omelette. So take it out like every minute, mush it up, take it out, mush it up, take it out, and just repeat that until it's a uh, texture you like. And that's pretty much it, guys. Um, I'm just gonna have 100 grams of veggies as well. So, I think we're still in. 100 grams of peas. Oh, too much. Back off, back 
back off these. We're good. Because I will be the first person to blame if she doesn't get good placings, what's the bet? She might keep overfed me. I would happily take the blame, it's okay. Someone's gotta take the blame. Do you know what, that's an interesting topic. Coaches, or anyone, should take the blame. That's just my opinion. It's always a learning experience, but to hold your hands up and be like, that was the wrong call, takes a, takes a big thing to do. So, it's good. Anyway guys, back to the egg yolks. I'm pretty sure Michael will film this so it's not fucking long. Hey, anyway, I'm just gonna show you what it's done. And there we have it, team. Boom, this is your quite fucking hot. This is your eggy oats. So, pretty much just kind of did it. I think it was in there for about three and a half minutes, roughly. Um, and just literally just. It's just, it doesn't taste of like. The benefit of egg wise, it literally doesn't taste of anything. It's just like. It adds more volume to the meal, so if you're hungry, it's better than whey protein. It adds a lot of volume. And as soon as you put in some flavor drops, we gotta put in our honey, because otherwise she'll kill us. So we gotta put some honey in for it. Not some honey. We're not putting honey in, I don't know why I'm saying honey. She's obsessed with cinnamon, so we gotta put the cinnamon on. And I know she wants to put way more on as well, so I will just put whatever's left in here. Mix it in. So yeah, egg whites just super easy to digest. Tastes bomber with everything. So if you haven't tried the egg whites, give them a go. Just don't turn it into an omelette. But yeah, this is pretty much it. One second. That's it. I don't know if you can see that very well. Camera to focus, yeah. That's pretty much it. I know she will enjoy this one. So yeah, well, that's pretty much it guys. Let me try, make sure it's tripod. Put it the swing. What I'll do is, <laughs> you're on a big tripod, <laughs> this is awkward. Um, we'll just post up my food throughout the day, things like that. We'll probably just scatter it through these videos and things like that. Or just the total calories up now. Um, we actually don't know how many calories Steph's eating. She's just following a strict meal plan and we adjust if we need to. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it guys. That is pretty much it. We're gonna sit down, enjoy our Saturday evening um, and we are back into full swing.